All right, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica. Today we are filming an update for my Pan That Palette series. Um, and this year it is a Pan Those Palette series. Um, I have like three different little palettes that are quads, trios, and a face palette. And also my upstairs neighbors are making a lot of noises. <laughs> um, they're being kind of loud this today, which is chill. Um, but just a little apology if you can hear like banging and stuff. I think they're moving or, or something like that. But um, yeah, that's going to happen. There's not much more I can control of that. But anyways, so let's get started. Um, the first thing we have is my MAC quad and I'll do pictures from last month and this month. Just expansion, pan expansion. So there we go. I'm using this every as much as I possibly can on the lid. This on my inner corner. Um, I also use Fix Plus with this, MAC Fix Plus, because the pigment isn't really like there, but these shadows are fairly old, so I think it's it's <laughs> it's just the age of it. Um, but yeah, just pan expansion, which is great. I am still loving these colors, really easy to use, everything's chill, but I just really want to finish these by the end of the year and I feel like I don't know this last week I basically have only been using these because I'm just really determined to do that like I just want them out of my collection and start moving on to another pan that palette or whatever and again not necessarily that I'm bored with these colors or anything like that I just would really like to see my collection um shrink <laughs> so yeah, and everything my, and by doing that, I would like to have it shrink by me using it. Um, so yeah, I'm just kind of determined to continue to use this up. Since the pandemic and everything, my schedule has been a little weird in terms of my job is not regular per se. Um, I get usually contracted by the day. And so sometimes I'm working like four to five times a week and sometimes I'm working no times a week so on the daily like my makeup use usage is gonna vary um I mean I could wear makeup every day but if I'm just like hanging out or if I'm gonna go surf or you know out at the beach then I'm not going to put on makeup <laughs> so yeah unless I miss it but if I'm gonna be out in the sun all day like having a good time like then I won't but if I'm gonna be working or you know going on a so having a social event or whatever then I will but yeah basically I sometimes I'll wear makeup every single day in the week and then I'll wear makeup no days in the week so that's just gonna be my biggest hindrance um for a minute there I was really I had like a lot of a very busy work schedule um and so I was wearing makeup a lot um like regularly which was great um and so I was able to kind of mix it up with my other project pans as well, which I also really liked. But yeah, I don't know. I guess I'm just, I'm going to see how I, how I do. I kind of want to like, almost say I want to dedicate like a whole month to just using this. But at the same time, I'm like, do I want to take away time for my other projects too? Because I like those other things as well. So I'm not really sure. I guess I'm not really sure where I'm at. But I just want to see lots more progress. I think I would be less concerned. I mean... Also on this, this is such a tangent, oh my goodness, but also on this, before on this shade in particular, I mean, there's a little bit of pan expansion, but essentially I had almost like a straight down dip into it, very like isolated. And now I'm not sure if you can tell, but it's definitely like wearing away, like there is a slope now um, on this pan, like pretty much all around. Before it was kind of like straight and then a dip, and now it is kind of going in all the way around. So, you know, that could also be something where I'm like, I'm not seeing as much progress as quickly as I would like because it, there's progress happening in other areas versus just like expanding the pan. However, I know that there still is like pretty good growth of, in the pan. So I'm not, I don't know. I'm of two minds. I'm not like being hard on myself, but at the same time, I'm like, I would like it to move faster. <laughs> so um, anyways, Next, let's do the IBY Beauty Little Trio. Okay, so the only thing I'm working on right now is this one. As soon as I finish that rose gold shade, 
this one for my inner corner highlight, I will start using this. And of course, once I use this completely, I will use this gold shade. But for now, just this little brown shade. As you can see, definitely expanded the pan. I also have been trying to target like this side of the pan um, with my brush. Not sure. There we go. You can kind of see it just to try and get some side pan. And yeah, I mean, super powdery, powdery. Um, but I'm also trying to be really, really careful because I know once I hit that side pan, the structure of the pan itself is going to start getting really crumbly, um, which is fine. I can always repress, but I don't necessarily want to do that. So I am being like really gentle with this. So it's probably making my progress a little bit slower, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. Um, not that I'm normally like really harsh with it, but I am extra gentle with that. I'm like, okay, like, let's make sure to only get what we need. <laughs> let's not like, you know, try to hit that structure too much, um, just to compromise it. So yeah, that is that one working on that. Uh, hopefully next month we have a side pan, but we'll see. Okay. So now the more, most exciting part of this, let's do the Alme trio. So as you can see, um, I believe I was still working on this shade and that's gone. Yay. I mean, we've predicted it, but look how much of this dark brown shade. And I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, you pretty much can. It's very shallow in there, which is so cool. This is going to be gone by next month. Um, and then I believe Makeup and Sanity said to maybe I could, and actually a few people did, maybe I can repress whatever is left from this shade into this quad to make my life a little easier and I was definitely planning on doing that however I think this is going to be gone really really quickly so I'm not even going to worry about that um I think I have maybe a week and a half left of this so it's just you know less of a trouble to repress um but you all this will be gone this will be gone by next month 100 percent. it's gonna be gone that's very exciting um okay so Let's do my Hourglass Face Palette, pictures from the last month and this month. Okay, really exciting here as well. We have um, more of the great showing, lots of progress. I mean, not lots, lots, but you know, basically we had these two little dots showing and now we have these two great showing. Um, and then it is nice and flat are starting to get, I mean, there's a little bit of a, you know, um, hump there, but not too much. And yeah, I mean, this one's really exciting because every time I use it, I feel like I see more and more of the great, you know, being exposed. So hopefully by next month, I think it'd be really cool, which who knows if we can get like two more rows of these to show. Um, or even like if we can just get it all the way, all of this product used up. I'm not sure if that's asking too much. <laughs> it might be, it might be a little too ambitious, but I think that that would be such a fun, like visual to see. So we'll see, we'll see, but I'm enjoying it. And after this is gone, then this whole palette's gone and that's huge. So the first part of the video was a little down and I don't mean to get myself down, but yeah, I guess I'm just like really wanting, I just, I'm like, in my head, I'm like, okay, like you've been working on this little quad for two years. One year was the pandemic year. So I mean, like, <laughs> you know, <laughs> give yourself a break, but I've been working on this for two years. And so, you know, I'm like, I, I want to, I want it done. <laughs> like, I just want it done. Um, but yeah, so hopefully, you know, either side pan more, lots of more growth, whatever. I am trying to get side pan in this shade and this shade, like right here, I am targeting it a little bit. Um, and no such luck yet, but I mean, I am still seeing growth in the whole pan. So obviously I'm not only targeting that, you know what I mean? So we'll see, but hopefully maybe like side pan or just keep on growing the pans. Um, hopefully side pan on IBY beauty and the Alme going to be freaking gone. That is going to be so cool and exciting. And once this is gone, this whole Alme trio, I can go ahead and add that to my Project 50 pan, like as an item used up. So that's even more exciting. And then hopefully, um, you know, we use up like where it's like half the product is gone on this. So that's my update. 
oh my gosh, it's a very exciting month. I'm very excited. Um, and I'm determined to finish that Mac quad. We can do this. I got this. Um, I hope you all are doing well on your project pans, your pan that palettes and those palettes. Please let me know how you all are doing. I always love to hear. And yeah, um, I hope you're having a good day. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.